Now, and welcome to your gold market update for today as we approach the midpoint of the Asian session. It is Monday the 19th of June 2023. We're delighted to see you here. Hope you had a good weekend. It's Mike Smith, Senior Analyst at Gold Markets to lead you around what's happening today. Of course, on Friday, the US equity market snapped a six-day winning streak as markets pause going into what is a long weekend. Today, US futures are mildly lower in the Asian session. Asian markets are mixed in today's trading so far. The ASX is the outperformer, uh, up 0.4% with most of the sectors bar one in positive territory. European futures are pointing to a lower open this afternoon and the VIX continues to drop, sets new lows not seen for over three years now. The US dollar index holds five-week lows with a small gain on Friday. Slightly higher in Asia today, all commodities are slightly weaker in Asia this morning. Gold bounce off supports now testing the top of the short-term range, though pausing today. Copper has paused beneath the 200 EMA after last week's rally and all is sitting near the top of the short-term range, but as I said, all mildly lower this morning. Bitcoin had a positive day on Friday, moving back above the 200 EMA, which it tested earlier in the week. It's flat in Asia today so far. And no significant data today to move markets, so it's going to be a technically orientated day. We do have the Chinese and Bank of England rate decisions later in the week. We've got global PMI numbers and, of course, Fed Chairman Jerome Powell testifying in front of Congress, being the week's highlights. A couple of charts that caught our eye today. Uh, the first is the GB Pound Australian dollar, and you can see there we're just trading underneath this key level at around about 187.50. Uh, this is a level that was last tested mid-May, and after a, a pullback in this pair, we're seeing some Aussie weakness this morning, uh, and could see a move up to this level later in the session, one to keep an eye on. On the ASX Suncorp, our uh, worth look, we saw a big spike in price today, which has pushed it through this previous key level at 13.40. If we take this right back, you can see the context of this. This is highs not seen since 2019 on this stock. And there certainly looks to be some buying pressure coming in. Whether it's got enough momentum to take it over that $14.11 towards $14.50 remains to be seen. There could be a pause around $14, but at this stage, it looks pretty strong and one worth some consideration, depending on where it closes towards the back end of the trading session. Trade safe and we'll see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.